while writing the film what did you have to go through you know in terms of making these characters making that turmoil and making them overcome it how was it like i just said that it's not just a film about women or for women it's also about men and for men because that's the way society is we cannot you know take out women and say we will only talk about them because we are coexisting and anything which uh, troubles or uh, is a matter of concern for one sex definitely affects the other sex it equally so uh, when i was writing it i actually discovered uh, three four really spirited stories about very very spirited women and i wanted to make a film celebrating these women because i realized that there was a lot of me in all of them you know uh, so somewhere it is all our story it's not it's not i'm not making a film about their story a lot of me is there in all these women a lot of uh, people that i know are there in all the characters of this film but yet this film is so rooted inside you know one small village where there is no education or there is a lack of information so um, that just tells you that human issues are the same worldwide and it's not about them and us you know tanishka says that she discussed the germ of the idea with you and from there it all began yeah. so what had happened that day that you know like instinctively you were telling me about conversations especially about sex that she had with women yes. in this particular village where she was shooting another film and i said that's so interesting that we think we are more progressive but the way these women are talking about sex is so much more real and so much more rooted and honest like just now somebody interviewing me called uh, sex the s word and i said you are allowed to say sex yes. you know so uh, because i really feel that uh, not just in our society in lots of societies a conversation about sex is important because we made a big deal out of it you know so to get rid of it we have to make it normal because it is normal you know by putting it uh, behind the cloud we are not helping because we are all having sex correct and that's the way uh, we expand that's the way we give birth and sex is like the uh, such a beautiful expression of love so why are we ashamed of it why is a thing of awe with it you know so that was the germ of the idea that let's make sex in the village and that's where we started from but then in today's uh, day and age you cannot talk about sex without uh, being concerned about a lot of issues around it so like that the film started getting layered with and uh, i think the conversation and the layering didn't end till we finished shooting the film you know uh, radhika says that her character is so diametrically opposite to what she is in real life while you are directing uh, people who are very opposite to what you know you want them to be in front of you does it get exciting or does it get a little difficult you know that's the whole uh, fun of working with brilliant actors i don't think i never try to cast people like the people i want I just cast brilliant actors and uh, because it's also it should be a journey of discovery somewhere for all of us right so in and I don't even it's not like I look for somebody that she should be very diametrically opposite to what I want to cast so um it should be a journey for you to discover another life and that's the way we that's the reason that's the high that we are all there in this profession for thank you for making such films thank you <laughs>